the 2021 Lexus LC 500 convertible. And this is not just any new LC convertible. This is the Inspiration Series. And in some parts of the world, it's known as the Special Regatta Edition. Plus, we're gonna announce all the winners to the ASUS ROG giveaway. So keep watching. Now I haven't really been doing this for too long, so I haven't really done a lot of doubles or variants of the same kind of vehicle. But when I got into this for the first time, it reminded me so much of the LC500 Coupe that I already lab mom tested. Although that one was a little bit more brighter on the eyes. And in many ways, this vehicle is very similar, but in many ways, it is markedly improved. For starters, you now have Apple CarPlay and Android Auto. And unless you like having your cords snaked out and dangled all over the center console, your phone tucks away so nicely under the center console space. Look at that beautiful armrest design. Push and it closes, which really discourages you from looking at your phone when you're driving. It also makes it look so clean, which is a very common theme in this LC. In that flare yellow coupe, it was a very camel on the inside. I mean, don't get me wrong, it was gorgeous. But in here, two-tone leather, it is absolutely stunning. The dark blue really gives it that modern feel. And everything just feels so soft to touch. And Lexus didn't just focus on soft touch. Oh no, look at the design elements on every surface. The door is a piece of artwork on its own. The carbon fiber sill as you enter the vehicle and you're reminded that you're in an LC Inspiration Series of 100. And the dashboard, aluminum pieces like on the gear shifter, the seat belt buckle strap. I said it before and I'll say it again, one of my favorites. It's like an embellishment you would see on a jacket. And it's magnetic, absolutely stunning. There's also a Mark Levinson audio sound system in here. If you're not impressed yet, just wait because it only is gonna get better. This vehicle is a perfect reminder that Lexus is truly king when it comes to seat comfort. No, this is not a super bolstered sports seat like you might find in a German sports car, but this is the kind of seat that you could sit in for hours and your tuchus won't go numb. You could seriously take a long road trip and really enjoy your ride. And even though there's technically a back seat, I think it probably serves a better purpose for some storage, luggage, things like that. Perhaps a dog but you would have to seriously tether and make sure that dog was protected. We don't want any uh, dogs jumping out, flying out. That, that would not be good. And now with Apple CarPlay, Android Auto, there's something for everyone. Well, except for you Windows phone users. And although it's still not a touch screen in here, the touchpad, actually, it works really good. I also appreciate that when you press the menu, home button, Android Auto, Apple CarPlay pops up respectively. In some of the other luxury brands, you're hunting around for it and that can get a little frustrating. Another fun thing about this LC500 convertible, it has Amazon Alexa. So if your home is integrated with Alexa, you can control your home functions in here too. I guess you can preset your oven before you go home, turn on some lights. I don't know, what do you do with that thing? I don't have one. Let's talk about some of these convertible features. The top, it retracts and goes back so fast. Is it the fastest? I don't know. This is actually the first convertible I've ever driven, but I got a timer, so let's make it official. I'm gonna press start and the button at the same time. So here we go, three, two, one. Done, 13.9 seconds. You see that? 
That seems pretty fast to me. I also love that you have a picture displayed right here up front as you push the buttons. It shows you exactly where it is in the process. And even better is where the switch is located, hidden under this little toggle. You feel like a superhero. Or like James Bond activating a special weapon in a car. And right next to it, an all window button. And to top it off, you could work the cover open, close up to speeds of 31 miles per hour. I mean, you don't even have to slow down traffic or pull over on the side of the road. How great is that? Now, at first I was thinking, with the top down, this is gonna be so noisy. But to my surprise, driving around main roads at 45, 50 miles an hour, it wasn't bad. And the best part, when I switched and put the windows up, it literally just feels like you're driving around with a big sunroof open. I was able to have a full-on phone conversation through Apple CarPlay. My husband had no difficulty hearing me. I had no difficulty hearing him. And on the plus, it's a natural volumizer. You're not gonna have to tease your hair in here, ladies. And you might get a little bit of a suntan, so wear your sunscreen, that might help. And the driving dynamics? Well, this is absolutely superb. This naturally aspirated V8 is seriously a piece of art. 471 horsepower and 398 pound-feet of torque. This Japanese muscle car sends all the power to the rear, so it's kind of funny that there's a snow mode right here on this motorcycle handle style stock. And amazingly, there was no performance sacrifices by cutting off the coupe roof. The Lexus engineers did an amazing job with reinforcing the chassis to make sure it continues to have Lexus comfort, predictability, and safety. And a huge part of that is the new ABS location, adaptive variable suspension. It's no longer at the top of the shock absorber, but rather below the spring of the lower shock absorber. The AVS has 650 levels of dampening to literally make the road feel so smooth. And whether it's raining or sunny, and believe me, it has rained a ton since I've had this thing, I've never felt like the car was difficult to handle. I'd still love to test out snow mode though, so Lexus, if you're listening, I'd love to get this in the wintertime with a set of snow tires. You can tell that this was very carefully thought out by the team at Lexus. Usually convertible mechanisms take up a ton of space. And although the trunk might be smaller in here, it is still a nice size. Also to make up for that extra weight from the convertible mechanisms, Lexus took out the spare tire and replaced the tires with run flats. Now usually I find run flats are a little bit louder, but in here, again, I don't know what Lexus did, but it is so quiet. And with the top open and the windows up like right now, this is honestly quieter than some of the other vehicles I've, uh, I've tested. And that is seriously good. What do you think? You want one? Well, the price on this Inspiration series is a little hazy, but I would expect to pay over 120 k And in my opinion, it's worth it. You're getting the last of a breed, a bona fide Japanese muscle car with the reliability of a Japanese automobile as well. The interior design is absolutely gorgeous, plus it's easy to drive. And the functionality of using that rear seat for extra storage, plus the trunk, it's a decent size too. It's not as big as the LC Coupe, but you could really haul a bunch of stuff in here as long as you're not carrying two large people or two large dogs. So is the Lexus LC 500 convertible lab approved? Well, maybe not. Andy approved, but it is definitely lab mom approved. Are we ready? And now for the winners.
Big congrats to all the winners. And if you didn't win, there's more chances to win because I'm going to be doing a random giveaway every month until the end of the year. All you have to do is be a subscriber to my Twitch channel and be live with me during one of my streams and I will randomly pick a winner. And this is what you could win, the ROG Strix 5700 XT GPU. So this is for September. This is for October. This one is for November. And then this is for December. But for December, let's make it a little extra spicy. On top of this 5700 XT, I'll also add a 3960X Threadripper CPU and a ROG Zenith 2 Extreme Alpha motherboard. So it's basically like giving away almost an entire computer. All you have to do is be a subscriber to my Twitch channel and hang out with me live. Big thanks for watching this video. Stay tuned for next week's lab-tested review. We'll see you next time. Bye.